Unprotected, a memoir by Billy Porter, is a powerful and emotional autobiography that delves into the life, struggles, and triumphs of the Tony and Emmy Award-winning actor, singer, playwright, and director. Porter, known for his talent and trailblazing presence in the entertainment industry, especially for his role as Pray Tell in the television series Pose, shares his journey from a challenging childhood to becoming a celebrated artist and LGBTQ advocate. Born in 1969 in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, Billy Porter was raised in a deeply religious and homophobic environment, which posed a serious challenge to his identity and aspirations from an early age. Battling with the strict religious beliefs of his Pentecostal family, Billy faced extreme difficulties in accepting and expressing his true self. Throughout his childhood, he grappled with the torment of his stepfather's sexual abuse and the complex dynamics within his family that left him feeling vulnerable and unprotected. Despite the traumatic experiences and a society that often rejected him, Porter found solace and hope in music and theater. He demonstrated a passion for performance early in his life which became his refuge and guide. From singing in the church choir to attending the Pittsburgh Creative and Performing Arts School, Porter showed an aptitude for performance that would eventually blossom into a fulfilling yet arduous career path. Porter attended Carnegie Mellon University's College of Fine Arts and achieved his BFA in drama. Following college, he moved to New York City with dreams of starring on Broadway. However, he quickly realized the harsh reality of being a black gay man in an industry that wasn't ready to embrace his full identity. He faced typecasting and discrimination, limiting his opportunities to roles that were often peripheral or stereotypical. Porter persisted, though, honing his craft and finding pockets of the performing arts world where he could shine. In the mid-1990s, Porter's career took off when he landed a role in Miss Saigon, and shortly thereafter, his breakout role in the Broadway musical Grease, where he played Teen Angel. Still, even as he found success, he continued to battle the personal demons of his past, including the trauma of his childhood abuse and the struggles with his sexuality. He also navigated the difficulties of the HIV-AIDS crisis, which deeply affected the community around him and led to him being diagnosed as HIV positive. The memoir is candid about his HIV diagnosis, which he kept secret for years due to stigma and fear. It intertwines the personal struggles with health, sexuality, and acceptance with his professional challenges and achievements. Regardless of the personal trials he faced, Billy managed to keep his HIV status a secret to avoid potential backlash that could jeopardize his blossoming career. In addition to his stage work, Porter recounts his ventures into the music industry as a solo artist, reflecting on his creative process and the release of solo albums that received critical acclaim but did not garner mainstream success. He also talks about his exploration of writing and directing as other avenues to tell stories and create representation for underrepresented voices in the arts. A turning point in Porter's life and career came with the role of Lola in the musical Kinky Boots. It was a part that not only showcased his incredible talent, but also symbolized a melding of his identity, bringing together his masculinity and femininity in a character that became an emblem of empowerment and acceptance. For his performance, he received numerous accolades, including a Tony Award for Best Actor in a Musical in 2013. Unprotected, a memoir also delves into Porter's personal life, including his journey to self-acceptance and love. He discusses his relationship with his mother, his marriage to his husband, Adam Smith, and the evolution of his views on religion, which moved from oppressive to a more personal and accepting spirituality. These relationships are depicted as pivotal in helping him to heal from his past and in shaping the man he has become. Porter describes the impact that the role of Pray Tell on Pose had on his career and visibility. The groundbreaking series, which highlighted the lives of Black and Latinx LGBTQ individuals in the Harlem ballroom culture during the 1980s and 1990s, earned him critical acclaim and an Emmy Award, making him the first openly gay Black man to win the accolade in the Outstanding Lead Actor category. Throughout the memoir, Porter emphasizes the importance of visibility and representation in the media. 
advocating for more stories that reflect the diversity of the human experience. He discusses the weight of responsibility he feels as a black queer artist to pave the way for others and to use his platform to challenge the status quo and promote change. As much as, as, much as unprotected, a memoir is an intimate recount of Porter's personal triumphs and tribulations. It is also a critical commentary on society's treatment of black queer individuals and a call to action for better understanding and inclusivity. He doesn't shy away from discussing the intersections of race, sexuality, and gender that have shaped his experiences, and he provides a no-holds-barred look at the discrimination he has faced in all facets of his life. Ultimately, unprotected, a memoir is a testament to Porter's resilience. Emerging from a world that often made him feel unworthy and invisible, he has forged a path that is uniquely his own. The memoir concludes with a sense of hope and empowerment, as Porter acknowledges the progress made both in his life and within society at large, while recognizing that there is still work to be done in the fight for equality and acceptance for all. Through his life story, Porter shares a narrative of overcoming adversity, embracing one's authentic self, and the ongoing journey toward healing and self-discovery. It is a memoir that resonates with anyone who has felt marginalized or unseen, offering inspiration from a man who has risen to prominence by being unapologetically himself. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.